Asking people shit yeah, like they, that. Yeah, they don't give a fuck now. Hey, I don't know if y'all know, it was a pandemic last year. Y'all ain't give a fuck. We was looking in Florida like, them niggas is free down there. We got to get down to Florida. Everybody at top got that shit. I know they do. That's why they don't want to be down here with y'all. They like, we scrape. <laughs> Look at the white people who invented it. Yep, y'all did. Shit, them the white people that came to determine if we getting the Illuminati or not. That's why y'all sitting there. I don't know if I like them that much. Y'all know leave us? Them. Like, unfold your legs, white man. Y'all know us? Y'all leave them alone. Because after this show, they might come up and say, hey, guys, HBO wants to work with you. Man, I give a fuck. How y'all know us? Why y'all sit in front row? I'm watching y'all. They probably own the building. We're, we're the vice stars. Yeah, we're the Vice Star family. Yeah, we My just grandfather came. owns this property. <laughs> we're the Vice Star family. We just came to see what you guys were doing tonight. I thought our white friend finna ask me questions. So what you do? What you do? Do construction. Y'all do construction? That ain't, nigga, that ain't nothing specific. Fuck <laughs> wrong. For who? For who? All types. Oh, for all types. I was just trying to figure out how you know us niggas. <laughs> you laughed too hard at that white man. Ha! <laughs> Oh, I was waiting on it. God, oh, finally I get to let it out. Jesus. How do they know us? I don't know. I, I'm scared now. Nah, fuck that bullshit. Huh? They sit in front row, too. You watch us? You been watching us forever? Oh, how long? Know? How long, nigga? You talking about saying forever, nigga? How long we been doing this shit? <laughs> fuck you talking about? You talking about forever, boy. You got to be fucked up. Bye, beat your ass. Yeah, that I'm, sound like I'm pissed off shit. now. They got me fucked up. Nigga, who are you? You wanna look at me? I'm gonna look at you. There's too much shit going on. I got to make it home to my kids. Who is that? Hey. I see a few of y'all have not subscribed to Channel 85. I don't know what it is. So look, you need to get the promo code. Listen, the promo code to get 10% off for the whole year, it's trial. So go sign up, channel 85, and when they ask for the promo code, type in trial, you can get 10% off for the whole year. It's exclusive content, behind the scenes content, you get to watch the podcast early, you get to see clips and outtakes and compilations and things that you don't even know that we over here doing. Did you know I have a cooking show? Huh? Did you know I have an art show where we just do black people art like Bob Ross? I ain't dropped it yet, but I got one. Yeah, and I got another show that I'm gonna put the 85 percenters in. I'm gonna just come over y'all house and just eat dinner. Yeah, if, you, if your house is nice and you want us to come over there and eat with y'all, send the info. You could get in one of these shows. But it's very low budget. Damn near free. Especially if I'm producing it. So, we paying in exposure first. But I'm saying, use the promo code TRIAL. I get which. That's my new thing, turning my back on people. Wait a minute, I got some breaking news, man. man I don't know, I don't know everybody in here today Come on. what you've been doing. I don't know if you heard something or you Come said on. something. I don't know what you've been into or what you're about to do. But we trapping for real today mm, in here. Mm. You know what I'm saying? Cause we got living legends in here with us. Come on, man. You know, some people like to have a little talk. But no, today we having a little chat. You come know? on, man. We we got the chat. Hey, hey, come on. Hey, man, welcome to the trap. Welcome to the trap. One of the hardest hey. rapping ladies to ever pick up hey. a microphone to get in the booth. Attack every beat. I'm talking about oh, every verse from, 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 the, from, the, from the jump. Somebody getting their ass whooped. <laughs> Me mugging all in the video. I ain't never pussy put it on the track. The only, the only person I ever seen talk shit back to Project Pat. Come on, man. man Told what? niggas to lick the cat. Come on, man. One of the hardest from the mafia. One of the official queens of Southern hip hop. Come on. Le Chat. Le Chat. Le Chat. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Know the fuck is who's really from down south. No. Let's go, let's go, let's go. 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 Let's go,
Come on, Young right. name supposed to come up every time they bring up rap. It ain't just on, about man. no fucking male or female. You always had a hard ass verse. And like he said, niggas would sit there and listen to your whole album because it wasn't like you sitting here listening to girl music. You get what I'm saying? Right. Yeah, I make nigga bitch music. Oh, shit. You make what now? Nigga bitch music. Yeah. Yeah, yeah I, I get because the real niggas gonna feel it. The real bitches gonna feel it. You get both sides of the perspective. Yeah. Because you gotta look, yeah, I see it. That's what it's called. I Ooh. see it. You well, got I, rap, you got hip hop, and you got nigga bitch music. And yeah, you the queen of that genre. <laughs> Who else fucking with you? I, first of all, I didn't even know that was a genre to right now. I didn't either. I thought it was shit. I thought it was just country rap tunes. You know yeah, what I'm mean? saying? I thought it was just Everything shit. come out of some country rap tunes. Yeah, so. that, that, that's chat, mate. Yeah, chat, yeah. yeah. <laughs> so first of all, welcome to the trap. Thank y'all, man. Oh, you've been doing your thing. Thank you so much. We say it every time somebody come here, we don't interview nobody. We just want them to come through the trap so we can tell them personally that we fuck with them. Show some love why people can hear you say it. Yeah. Well, I mean, we fuck with y'all too, though. Well, come on, now. What's up? Find the funniest <laughs> up coming, y'all. Yo. We saw y'all coming up. Y'all came up. Come now. on, now. It's, it's a trap. We up. It's a trap. We up. We got A. It's a, it's a trap. <laughs> <laughs> no, nah, but you really here, because when we came to Memphis, you hit me and you said you was coming to the show. And we damn sure appreciate that, because, you know, I've been a fan since way back when you was rapping with Tommy Wright. Oh, Come okay, on. yeah. Way right back before, third. before on, all of that shit, so. Well, you know, really, I started with uh, Triple Six, like, uh, 94. Right. And then, like, we did the uh, Juicy J Underground. I could have been, like, 13, 14. For real? Damn. Way back then. Then, you know, we did Mr. Styles. And then, the, you know, the Devil Devil with the Tommy Rights and all yeah. that came out. Yeah, yeah. So, I've been around, you know. That shit crazy because I don't think motherfuckers know how far ahead in the future Memphis motherfuckers was. You yeah. said 94. 94. And, and the beats and the flows sound but like what niggas doing now. Most of these songs and they sound like they came out today. Yesterday. 94 yeah. was like Mr. Styles, but yeah. it could have been like my yeah. 92, 91 when me and Juice first linked. I was mm -hmm. like 13, 14 years old. What was that like? What was the just that? Yeah. Well, uh, uh, I knew the cat named Lil Nord. Shout out Lil Nord. He was already working with Juicy. And uh, we was going to East Summer School. Bad ass, you know, failing and shit. We, were, <laughs> <laughs> we went to Summer School. He, he was already bumping. Now you say, man, I can rap. You know, man, he can't rap. You know what I'm saying? We rapped against each other. I bumped him. We did a little talent show. He came first because he was already known. They cheated me. Right. Y'all cheated me. They right. cheated me. Right. I came second. Right. And uh, he was like, man, I'm going to get Juicy on them. I was like, I ain't gonna get you to my number. You ain't no giving juice to my number. And I get a call one day, like, hello? Hey, yeah, 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 this juice, juice, I heard you can rap, I heard you can rap. I'm like, uh, yeah, I can rap. He's like, spit something for me. I'm like, uh, my mama home? <laughs> he like, uh, I'm like, I thought you wanna rap. I'm like, I do wanna rap. He was like, spit something. I'm like, no, my mama home. He said, ah, oh, man, I thought you wanna rap. He hung up. I said, ah, oh, man, my wife had to be at home shit. right now, man. You could spit that shit in front of your mama. Not Mine. that shit you be spit. That was the one time I ain't want mama to be home. Damn. All that time that she be gone, I be like, Mom, come on. Mine, mom, why you had to be home? So anyway, he called back, though, two hours later. He like, yeah, 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 what's up? How you doing? This Jordan. Now, Jordan, different business, Juice Jordan. Yeah, this Jordan, I heard you can rap. I was <laughs> like, yeah, I can rap. you like, let me hear something. This time, I went down to the end of the driveway, outside, end of the driveway. <laughs> cool was on the corner, Mom? Mine. And I rapped, I rapped my ass off. I rapped like shit. He was like, damn, I, thought, I don't know if he thought he finna hear bubble gum, bubble gum, bubble gum, I don't know what he thought he finna hear. He got there and nigga, what the fuck he said? I'm a bunch of fucking hair, I'm about to tell you the trick, dick, 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 bitch. He like, woo, what a minute. And then she, he said, I want to get you on something. The next day, he pulled up. Pulled up with the little tape recorder, you know, you can record and play. And you come with the microphone back in the days, you know, back in the 90s, you know. Yeah, we had yeah, yeah. We record and play, you take the microphone, and then you get the other person the headphones, and then you record. That's how he recorded us. And it came out. And from that point on, you know, the world knew check and rap. Ain't stopped since. No, ain't stopped ever since. Hey. Yeah. Damn. <laughs> Shout out Juicy for that. <laughs> Making plays, man. You gotta start somewhere. 
Mm-hmm. That's crazy. You had to rap on the cordless phone out in the yard. You got as yeah. far as you could get with the signal. Ooh. <laughs> I got so far. I want to miss that chance, though. <laughs> so what yeah. is what is your journey just been like through this whole music journey, like Man. the whole industry? You know, it's been to amazing. Go from that to you know, it's been amazing. You know, I was. 13, 14 years old, now I'm happily 43. Yeah. You know, Come y'all. on. You know, right, right, right. I'm still making money off of it. You yeah. know, I'm still relevant. I'm still, people, you know, still loving it. And that, 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 that makes me feel good. And I'm glad that it makes me proud to see that Juicy, uh, you know, saw me and put me out here. That means he did something right, you yeah. know. Yeah, he yeah. saw it. Yeah, I want to so, ask you, have any like the new generation rappers reached out to you for a verse or any type of shit like that? Well, not really, but you know, they show me how much, you know, I like... They be sampling, right? What it is, yeah, they, ooh, they be stealing. That's what they be doing. Okay, they don't be shit. sampling nothing. They be stealing their ass off. <laughs> <laughs> Pay the check on goddamn money, man. Hey, man. No, call the goddamn phone. You gonna steal yeah, that? Yeah, I'm still yeah. alive. Yeah, man. Man. Don't, do that, no, don't do that, dog. Don't do that. Features on that. Hell yeah. But yeah, right. they be stealing their ass out there. They got my voice, they they do all that, but they ain't reached out to me. But you know, I'm in my own little world too, so maybe I'll probably come where they at or something, they might, you know. Yeah. But you know, I'm in my own little world. Yeah. Uh, yeah she, so. she, she, she and I rap some of y'all too, so <laughs> get, get your shit together. Yeah. Yeah. So. Tell us about your experience in Memphis and how that shaped your music. Ah, oh, man, Memphis is. Memphis, man, there's no other city like it, you know. For Everybody real. got their own thing that's going on. It ain't, people always talk about the crime. It ain't just about the crime, it's the people, you know. Like I say, we some hating motherfuckers, but we some money getting motherfuckers. Loving, my smart, ride or die. The streets go teach you. Living in Memphis is learning. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, if you live in Memphis, you gotta learn some shit. It's like a living experience. Yeah. That's what I think about Memphis. Damn. You said Living in Memphis is learning. Like, it's hating so but down from from the money just... getting motherfuckers. Hating but hustling. Shit. Damn. Mm-hmm. That's, what, that's where all the hate at, where they get some money. Money bring hate. Come on, man. I'm telling you, it can turn motherfuckers to a hater. They just like wanted to see you get it, but then when you get it. Right. It's all they don't want to, you to get it, though, too. So it's all hate to, like, Niggas don't even just hate for no, they just hate for no reason. They don't give me a purpose. They just want to get you out the way. They don't give a fuck, they got to do life behind it. They don't give a fuck what will come behind as long as you gone. That's yeah. how I mean, the Memphis get like. That sounds like some evil shit. Right. Deadly, evil, crazy ass shit. But you got to be from there to survive it. But once you be from there, there's no other place that you really want to be. Yeah. If you with this shit, you know, you got some people that be like, Fuck Memphis, but then you got some people that be like, man, I wish a motherfucker would play with me. Right, <laughs> right, right. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah. y'all better not fuck with me in Memphis. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. So. <laughs> that shit seemed to be everywhere, man. Hey, yeah. You just gotta stick and move, man. Yeah. And keep but you got, y'all got to, y'all like, yeah. Y'all like some legends, you know what I'm saying? Like even in other cities, so I can imagine how Memphis got them. Yeah, we be like, you know, we rap, that we be having conversations <coughs> on the beat. So, you know, that's pretty much what we doing. We, we be talking to y'all, you know, yeah. telling y'all what our life like, what we going through, what our nigga just did, what we just saw, you know, that's how we be doing. Yeah. People always ask like rappers, like who was some of your influences? Uh, my, my favorite rapper is MC Light. I love me Sam C. Light. When I was going to school, I portrayed her in a talent show. I am the light, 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 that's all right. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? You know? I love Sam C. Light because, you know, for one, just like me, y'all see, I'm a little feminine now, you know. New hard ass shit. She hard as a right. motherfucker. But uh, when she came in the game, man, she had the thuggish clothes, you know, she wasn't yeah. about trying to show no ass, no body, didn't give a fuck what you thought she looked like, smell like, none of that, but you had to respect them lyrics, right. though. Yeah, and, right. and, and that's what you do. I love women that come and earn their respect. Don't don't cheat yourself and get respected. Don't go fucking suck and show your butt, you know what I'm saying? Come like, on. earn Damn. your respect. And that as a that, young that was, that was a whole <laughs> goddamn bar, man. Just out the blue. <laughs> <laughs> 
So as a young girl, me, and, and that was weird because think about it, MC Light was popping a long time ago. So I was a young girl, girl. I was like in, I know Junior had seventh grade uh, imitating her. Yeah. So for me to be that young and just focus in on her, yeah, she been my favorite. That's what's up. That's what's up. Yeah. She cool too. Yeah. She ain't cool like. But out you said that one that earned they got their respect. Like earned. You, yeah. Yeah. Earned it. So yeah. they already know, you know. And it show. When I come so. to the club, man, I got all the homies and all the hood homegirls and all that. They already know. I ain't chatting on shaking them, man. This sucks right here. You know what I'm saying? Like, we ain't, I ain't, I don't even get disrespected in shows. Like, I don't have to worry about no nigga touching me or right, spitting right, on me because right, right, they right. already know. Man, right. this ain't what we doing. Right, right, right. <laughs> right. No, we, we ain't doing it. Right. You know, so it's just all about respect. And just by people listening to my music and just seeing me as a person, I earn my respect, you know. You and damn I, sure and I did. Love then you got the goals in there. <laughs> yeah. Fuck with them, man. Most of the goons be the motherfuckers that I don't know. They be ready to chat up with motherfucker. Better not fuck with you over here. <laughs> I'm telling you, my nigga, you my nigga. You better not fuck with up over here. <laughs> now that's real love. When you go to another city and, and a nigga tell you that shit, when yeah, nigga starts to you, man, who is this nigga, man? <laughs> <laughs> this nigga came over here. Hey man, about to take that fuck with you. <laughs> I put that on me. <laughs> It's crazy, like I do shows and I, we do them shows, boy, and they just think they just had to fight. Look, we not, like I just come to see a fight. A fight just had to break out. I remember I was walking through the club one time and a nigga walked right, wait, right, right till I got next to him and just fired on the nigga next to him. Knocked him out. Oh, Lord. For you. No, for me, for me to see. I yeah, guess, you know, that nigga look back at you me. like. Oh, yeah, man. Like, I've seen a nigga jump in another nigga fight. <laughs> he just, he don't even come with that nigga. That nigga took his shirt off and said, knock this nigga ass out. <laughs> <laughs> then he stuck his fist out and just ran in the crowd. Damn. Hey, he didn't give a fuck who he hit. It, it, but, but your music did kind of, you know, that. How was that? that? Like your, just your music just charged up. Man. That's what I'm saying. It gets somebody that amped up to where they wanna square up. They was gonna I do know. that shit anyway. That's why I ain't, I ain't I wasn't mad at them. I know. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. That shit. It's like man, you know, my, I go to the club and end up coming up with a song. You know, I walk through that's just how the atmosphere be. Yeah. Walk through the club, you know, be like, they go check. Next thing I know, I fall up in the club, man. I wake you up, whisper. You know what I'm saying? Ooh. Like, yeah. Hey, I make you all whisper. Like, I got a bitch on with this shit. I'm letting that thing rip. Come on, oh. you know what I'm saying? Ooh. So, that's just like, that's just how I mean it is. You yeah. know, you fall out somewhere, man. You end up with a whole rap. How you get the name Lil Chet? Um, my real name is Chastity, and okay. I was calling myself. <laughs> Optimo at first. Optimo, like yeah, the blunt? like the blunt. Okay. And then I started calling myself Cha-Cha. And then I just came up with Lil Chat. But it was so many Lil Everybody's with the L-I-L. So I just changed it. L-A is pronounced the same, but spelled different. Yeah. And I just wrote right, with it. Hey, yeah. <laughs> she, it was too many little back then. Yeah, yeah. It's even more little. <laughs> it, it's extra little. However many little it was back then, but it's about times 400 more little. Yeah, this is a time where every Memphis rapper would look somebody though. That's what I'm saying. You separate. <laughs> For real. I ain't thinking about that. This y'all is yeah. a lot of little everybody. Everybody look. <laughs> Nigga 6'8". I'm a little big tall. Nigga, what? Look at you. And all the old niggas, yo. Man. <laughs> young ho, if you heard Jay Z, what? Well, you ain't you know young you ho no more. You know you done got old in the rap game where you could just drop the first part of your name. Damn. <laughs> Fuck it. I don't girl. know why they put an age limit on rappers, though. It shouldn't be. They it don't do it to be. nobody else. It's more old niggas than young niggas. For real. It's rock stars still out there. Motherfucker, 80 years old. With leather pants on and same skin. <laughs> but see, you got to do this one. You should do it in the 40s. But Go see, play one more. 
my grandson's here. <laughs> But see, some of these old niggas is old, still yes. trying to be young. Yeah. They got to at least still know how to be old. Yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> then you got to. Going, don't come out here acting like granddaddy. No, you ain't you still can't. thinking you the same daddy now. You have to add <laughs> grandchildren in that. You ain't daddy no more. You granddaddy now. You know what right, I mean? right. You so, gotta acknowledge that shit. We seen your wrinkle, nigga. <laughs> That's for real. We seen it. We seen it. Right what, what you call uh, Frank and Beverly and them? Oh, he's still rocking. Right. As long as goddamn they doing that cruise with Tom Joyner, <laughs> they always gonna have a job. For real. That damn boat better not leave without Frank <laughs> Beverly and May. Hey man, Frankie didn't make the ship. Man. The fuck you, you the mean? motherfucking liar. <laughs> Drop the anchor. Drop the motherfucking anchor. <laughs> Ain't no cruise without Frankie Beverly and May. Give a fuck if Frankie Beverly's here. Where's May? <laughs> Somebody get Roger on the phone. <laughs> Fuck. Shit. Man. Damn. Hell you talking about, man. It's just. Welcome back to the 85 South Show. Let's go. Let's go. I don't know if you've been paying attention. But we were in consideration for winning a daytime Emmy. Yeah? No, I'm just speaking shit into it. Okay, but that's what we're doing. I'm saying we didn't make it to it. I, I, I don't you know, know why they have the meeting where they talk about it. I was about to Somebody go put that said on my something shit. about it in the room, so that kind of count, don't it? <laughs> Just say it every now and then. Nigga, we this end. close to winning the Grammy. They, Grammy <laughs> oh, no, I promise you, next album I drop, I'm getting the Grammy. Comedy album. It ain't no rapping, though. I ain't even gonna be chat on in the news. That shit, hold on. I need a little chat intro. <laughs> no, she gonna be roasting your ass. Oh, no, I'm not. Because <laughs> I heard how she did pat on, on Chicken Head. Yeah, man. No. Hate to see you in the club. You might be with I'm not. I'm not going to let her ride the beat on me like that. Bro, it wouldn't be like, shit if we didn't talk about that legendary verse, man. You come flipped on, man. the whole script on that one. It stole the show. One of, okay, I'm going to say this. You know how motherfuckers always talk about top five shit. That's one of the top five back and forth rap songs ever, period. I'm not even talking about like man and woman, just like when niggas is going like bars for bars. Mm -hmm. Like, that's, that's in there. You that's really represented five. on that one. Well, thank y'all. We didn't even expect to be big. Y'all know I'm drinking, so I'm be sweating. That's all right. It ain't, ain't hot in here. Do your That's all right. It ain't Little hot in here. No, it's it tequila hot. right here. It, it, it ain't it. hot in here. <laughs> she brought me this tequila. <laughs> Disbelief. <laughs> oh, shit. Yeah, Disbelief tequila, man. It's based out of uh, these okay. guys from Tennessee. You got... Um, Tennessee, man. Yeah, Mr. Beans. You got um, Big Phil, man. They, they like, black-owned, distributed. We got to get them up here. They got to go check this out. Yo, we got to talk to them. They got white and brown. They want me to present you with the ball. Come on, we yeah. need it. Go Black it people there. selling liquor. We mm -hmm. drink it. We making everybody rich. We only selling liquor to people who drink liquor, though. We not trying to get no. nobody started drinking. Well, I don't want I'm nobody about The target market is people who already been drinking. Don't, yeah. This ain't for no kids. <laughs> this ain't for nobody who got stressed. This is for people who already drink. Drunk. Drunks. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Motherfuckers who drink tequila in the sun. But 10 o'clock in the morning, you had already on. breakfast drunk. That's the real drinking problem when you start oh, laying when you're drunk. Yeah. Nigga like, I'm, I'm breakfast drunk. Nigga drunk Nigga, again. Nigga, we day drunk. Right. <laughs> now we just drunk drunk. Drunk again, So did I see where uh, I started to slob on my cat challenge? Oh, my Lord. One day, yeah. See, you okay. got to people this on the okay. for See, real. Because no, 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 people no, take day, shit too day, literally. Already, we already went bowing with it. We already. Yeah, yeah. See, we went Pull so, it up. We went so bowing to, to the point that, uh, I went back and dropped the whole video 20 years later. It's on World Star right now. So you so, just dropped the video for it? Yeah, it was shot by this guy uh, called Rock Diesel. Uh, I got some beautiful ladies in there. Shout out Catrice. Uh, okay. Shout Pull out my other girl Jay. You know, uh, shout out Rock Diesel for doing this thing. It's on World Star on YouTube. Slob on my cat video. But it came from this, right? I did a show in Mississippi. Mississippi always send me out. Come on, come on. I come back to the house. Let's go. Like, I'm lit. I'm just like. Mm, I'm sitting around, the nigga sleep, you know, I ain't got shit to do now. I put, I done came home from the show too late. So now it's time for me to figure out what I'm gonna do. I said, I'm gonna do me slob on my catch. I went in the bathroom, 
Then they hit this TikTok shit. I'm like, give me some TikTok money, you know? Because yeah, yeah. I be getting them. Y'all get them checks from Facebook and yeah. Uh, yeah. Instagram yeah. and shit, you know? Yeah, I'm about to figure it out. I'm yeah. like, you check. really can get paid off this shit. I'm like, okay, I so I done hit the little slob on my cat, boy. I'm in there. I'm shaking and dancing and doing everything. Of course, we knew I had to be drunk because I was loaded the bitch. <laughs> <laughs> Them folks like, OMG, no chat ain't over here trying to twerk and doing this, that, that. My outfit, I had so many ladies coming with the slob on my cat challenge, man. I'm talking about, man, day after day after day after day after day. Then people start booking me shows where in the club they were doing slob on my cat challenge where the ladies, you know, do the little shaking, shaking. So I said, man, fuck that shit. I really was trying to steal my song back because, like I said, they were stealing You had to steal it. your song back. Yeah, they were using my vocals and putting it in there without, yeah. you know, hollering at me like I'm dead. You know, I'm still alive. Nah, man. don't do it. That's yeah. that bullshit, man. Yeah, yeah. man. <laughs> because if they would do some somebody else's music, they gonna have to pay them. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. Like, I don't know why we do us. I don't know. That shit crazy. I guess because they feel like, man, you know, I'm a hood bitch. I ain't going to sue them. But really, you know, I had you bad experience with, with suing it. Then I'd have been through so much court ass shit. I ain't going to sue you. I ain't going to lie. I ain't going to sue your ass. I don't give a damn. Fuck the courts, Ali. I just got blessed dealing with court. Right. But, uh, nah, when I got lawyers a long, long time ago, when it was time to separate from Paul and Juicy, you know, me not knowing that the lawyer gonna tell me, uh, stay away from them, they can't talk to you, you can't talk to them. Pretty much get in protective custody. If they call you, let me know. I'm a bone rush them, woo woo woo. I, I ain't knowing nothing this. I'm thinking I'm doing the right shit. My all the time, man, the lawyer, you know, really, really separating me from my family, you know, so. Damn. I ain't gonna sue you, I ain't gonna, I ain't gonna get a lawyer list. I gotta get somebody out of trouble, you know yeah. what I'm saying? But I'ma get on your ass, though. I'ma come hit you. And Talk I bet you, uh, that's for sure. You got to. <laughs> That's what that internet is notorious for. They'll steal yeah. some content. Man. Boy. At least yeah. shout me out. You know, I'd be like, just shout me out then, you know? I'm about yeah. to do that shit. I'm about to steal some of my content back. Like you know, these people take this show, then make a reaction video of them watching the show. They watch. So I'm going to make a reaction video <laughs> of to you me reacting to, to their them reaction. watching. <laughs> like, nigga, did you not hear that? <laughs> Right. Fuck, what, are you, right. what are you doing? These Let's ain't even good it. reactions. That's I can't even see your dope. face. It's a shadow. <laughs> like, who lit this for you? <laughs> that shit is hilarious. I'm doing it. Might as well. All like, these motherfuckers keep making all these fucking greatest moments, 85 South. Guess what? I'm stealing that shit and I'm uploading nigga. it on my YouTube. Greatest <laughs> moments, <laughs> like you for 10. We still alive, all nigga. the time editing that shit. <laughs> How I'm you gonna still, greatest moments, niggas? We right. still alive. Then it's insulting yeah. because the shit don't even get no views. <clears throat> don't nobody want to see it the way they made it. Man, stop stealing that shit. You said steal your, your shit, shit back. Yeah, I had to steal it back. I had to go I'm with that. Uh, Project Pat shit, cause you know Pat ain't going. Pat go lay it down. He gonna lay the smack down. So I had to yeah. turn the Project Pat and go steal my shit back. Yeah. Made a whole video of twerking. This how I came back. Turn that shit up. Look, talking about being Project Paper, made a whole video of twerk. <laughs> we're gonna make, we're gonna bring this shit back once this shit come out. Slob on my cat challenge. Yeah, it's our yeah. world star, the video. Send us uh, videos. Shout out Rock D's, we <laughs> filmed it. You know, I got a little lingerie, you know. No! A little bit. Doing the chicken head. <laughs> <laughs> Now that we had me sitting down, I would've been dancing my ass on that, but. Bro, what if your girl came in the bedroom with some lingerie on, doing the chicken head? <laughs> <laughs> my girl, what the fuck is you doing? <laughs> <laughs> she doing this hard, boy. too. You ain't got no choice but to say, I like the way you do that right here. <laughs> Give me what you got for a poke chop. That nigga say that, bro. <laughs> he said that. <laughs> that nigga said his name was Chingaling. Who the fuck called him that? <sighs> <laughs> hey, Chingaling! <laughs> Nobody said that. <laughs> oh. Damn. Rap is funny as hell, man, because they <laughs> sell hit that clip and get mad in the motherfucker. <laughs> and now we go. Thing you know, nigga did call me chicken <laughs> Everything ain't a joke. You can't say shit no more. Especially Soldier Boy. What? Oh, Lord. Don't let Soldier Boy in that shit. Oh, man. 
I think this is the first interview I did where I'm able to wipe my sweats. I like this shit. No, you can do this, this shit. And yeah. I'm like, we gonna cut it, let you, and then we come We gonna back. cut for what? This is real this shit. This shit and y'all don't okay. cut nothing. This is real. This is the perfect atmosphere. This shit don't cut nothing. This is raw. This shit gonna go straight to the street. I know, know he ain't cut his grass. When somebody cut me, you don't cut shit. You don't cut your ass off before you tell somebody to stop. This is the 85 South Show. 87% of the people that who watch this show is smoking in the bed right now. <laughs> in the bed. The birthday sheets up audience. repeatedly. Oh, shit. <laughs> <laughs> Where the ashtray at? Nigga, the ashtray under the cover. They've been Enjoy watching it. up to this point. They about well, to roll hey. up again. Hell yeah. Oh, oh, that shit. You know, you crazy. Oh, man. But I have dropped the album uh, called Drama Queen. I dropped you it drop? last year. Why you ain't tell me? I forgot about the motherfucker myself. I've been on my, I've been on my, I've been on one. I'm having a ball. Is it everywhere? Yeah, it's out everywhere. You can download it. Download yes. the album. I got go my brother it. Project All Pat the on album. there. Project Pat on there. I Come on, let's go. Get some boo on there. Get some boo on there. Yeah. Get some boo on there. Who? Crazy boy. Crazy boy on there. Yeah, bro. I got Mr. Womp Womp Fiend on there. Fiend on that beat. Come on. All right, you know. I got Fiend okay. on there. See, I'm the type of person like. I don't go off, you know, the clout or what your numbers is, whatever. I, I always think of who I can make a good song with, you know. They might say, oh, man, dude over there hot. I'm like, yeah, he is. Then I get to think, but what kind of song can I make for him? You know, right. like, features got to count. Mm. Like, don't, what if you get a song with what's called him and then the song whack as fuck? No, but see, it's what, a waste of see, that's why you come in there. It don't matter what the song is, just do that little chat shit. But I got to know that they going to be able to. Fuck them. You already said oh, okay. the song wasn't shit. <laughs> Don't let nobody fuck up your part. <laughs> <laughs> we'll skip their part to okay. get to your part. OK. <laughs> <laughs> I would love to see a little chat on the song with Bruno Mars. This nigga singing oh, about that. And then she just come out, pussy ass. Oh, you need to leave that. Man, that shit will be so goddamn hard. Don't Damn. never change your style. I don't give a fuck what the song is. R&B, I want you mugged up, gold grill, dog, everything. Keep that shit day. just like you had it. Hey. Too short ain't changed his rap style yet. Mine. Not at all. <laughs> 296,000 songs. Not at all. <laughs> Bruno Mars, man, get this little chat. Bruno get this, Mars and little on. chat would go hard as fuck. That shit Dang. would be banging. What's that shit? Soul Sonic? Silk Sonic? Silk Sonic, yep. Bruno Mars, Anderson Pack, Lil Chat, <laughs> Will I Am, <laughs> and Project Pat. Damn. There I go. Why y'all don't put, think? Bro, see, I put a little shit on the song with anybody. Think we, of somebody crazy. You thinking outside the box, and I like it. You I feel put me? her on one of you them DJ me? Kelly tracks with, with fucking Justin Bieber, Chance the Rapper, and Kesha. What? Who go? And Kesha. It will work. She gonna, it's, it's gonna work. It's gonna work or whatever you put it on. Benny Siegel. Shout out to Benny. Lil Chat. Okay. And Jack Thriller. What the fuck is Jack going to do? He's going to say something in the beginning. In the <laughs> beginning, What the fuck part. is Jack going to do? I just saw him you over there. You don't have him singing? I, I just saw him over there, man. But you don't have him. He just talking. He can know what he's talking about. That nigga know what he's talking about. All right. I'll get one track. He can talk in the beginning. Y'all had some good skits, too. Like, it was always some all guys love good skits. I put Lil Chat, Lil Baby, Lil Dirt. Every Lil. Look. Every Lil every look. Every look ever. I want every Lil. It's gonna, this song is gonna be called Every Look. Every it's look. gonna be Every Look. Every Look Chat. Ever. Come on. <laughs> every Look Ever. <laughs> Benny Man. Scissor. Look Chat and Adele. That's through the roof. That's through the roof. Come on, man. That's through the roof. You, Who would come you on, wanna man. do a song with? Man, I would actually want to do a song with DJ Paul, Juicy J, Project Pat, Gangsta Boo, Ooh. Crunchy Black, Ooh. Lil White, Ooh. C to C, Ooh, everybody. all on one track. Come on. 2022. Put that shit we together. We need a positive cut. That's what I want to do a song with. A positive cut. 
Yeah. <laughs> when they used, they don't do that no more. Remember they used to do them shits yeah. and them shits would go. I used to love the way they used to talk shit before the song started. Yeah, you fucking punk. I'm finna take your beat and go nationwide <laughs> with a bitch. Don't never bite the dick that feeds you. <laughs> hey, what's up? It's Carlos Miller. The NFL playoffs are here and DraftKings Sportsbook, an official sports betting partner of the NFL, is kicking things off with a huge offer. Counting down to Super Bowl 56, all new customers can get 56 to 1 odds on any wild card team to win their game. Bet just $5 and win $280 in free bets if your team is victorious. DraftKings is giving all new customers a free shot at millions of dollars in total prizes with their first deposit. Everyone can play for huge cash prizes with DraftKings Daily Fantasy Football Contest. If Sportsbook isn't available in your state yet, you still have something to play for this wild card weekend. That's promo code 85 South this wild card weekend at DraftKings Sportsbook, an official sports betting partner with the NFL. Download the DraftKings Sportsbook app right now. Use promo code 85 South and get 56 to 1 odds on any NFL team. Bet just $5 and win 280 in free bets. If your team wins, it's promo code 85 South. Download the DraftKings Sportsbook app right now. Use promo code 85 South and get 56 to 1 odds if your team wins. Must be 21 or older. New Jersey, Indiana, or Pennsylvania only. New customers only. Minimum $5 deposit and a $1 wager required. One per customer. Restrictions apply. See DraftKings.com slash sportsbooks for details. Gambling problem? Call 1-800-GAMBLER. That's 1-800-G-A-M-B-L-E-R. Don't ask me why I'm laying on the couch. Cause niggas been asleep on 85 South Show the whole time. Cat, what's the app? Channel 85. Channel 85? Oh, bro. So we got a whole streaming service. Yes, sir. I've been telling people it's an app. Streaming no, it's a streaming service. That's how you can go and get all the exclusive content. You can watch the car show. Like, we got a whole lot of shows we've been working on. People don't know. That's why I want to, they don't never see me lay on this couch. But once I found out they would sleep on 85 South Show, I'm going to start sleeping. I'm literally going to start sleeping on 85 South Show. Because that's what they've been doing. Bro, we got a whole streaming service with content they never seen before. Live shows, when the live shows are going to be on YouTube. They're going to be on the streaming joint. We done put all the, no, go, go download the app, streaming service app. It do look like a movie, Channel 85. When y'all go, no, go get the, go get the. All right, man, it's Channel 85. They sleep on 85 South Show, man. This couch comfortable as hell, but it's nasty. I feel like I'm, this is a real trap couch. When, when they can go get it? Right now. You don't have the promo code. It ain't one. That's how new it is. It's out right now. If you still watching this and you don't have the app, it's on everything, bro. It's on every app store. Apple TV, Android. I don't know what they what they use. Google Play. It's on Google Play. It's on Google Play. It's on the Apple Store. It's on Roku. You should just search it and see what it come up on. I'm going to sleep though. They sleep. They sleep, bro. Joe, what you got to say? Man, we gotta make a little button where you can just hear Joe laugh over and over again. That'll be hard. Whatever, man. Get the stream. Go stream this shit. If you wanna see the shit you ain't see. Good night, man. One of your coldest ones was with uh, Lunel. Oh, Lunel. Yeah. That was one of the coldest Who? freestyles. Yeah. Lunel? The one with Lunel. For real? Um, yeah. I'm trying to I think of the other one. I love Auntie. 
Cause I be kicking that shit. No hey, one y'all that's what I do. I just be kicking that shit like it's some shit on my shoe. Let's I like go. some shit on my boot. Cause Ooh. I be telling the truth. I like it tight, but that's all right. Cause I be making it loose. I tell Ooh. the truth when I come. I tell the truth when I go. Uh-huh. I know the difference between a dirty bitch and, and a shiesty hoe. Yeah. But they don't know that. I be knowing that they don't know though. <laughs> so I be trying to dodge me hoes. Don't take no photos. Hey, hey. Don't take you no photos. Bitch, ain't no surprise. Yeah. Don't take no photo. Bitch, look in my eyes. Yo, yo. <laughs> I think I was 19, and my oldest was 42. Mm-mm. That ain't necessarily no cougar, though. The hell are you talking what? about? I'm 19, 42? She's just older than you. 19 and 42, what you want me to be 70, my boy? <laughs> That coochie is never gonna work. 60? Oh my god. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't gonna get no coochie if I get some head. I know, cause the coochie don't work. Bitch, you just give me some head. She's still young. She's gonna jack you off. Bitch, stop telling me. <laughs> She's still, still young. That's, that's young, huh? Yeah. She would jack me off all day. Stop. I don't want you to jack me off. Move. Yes, you do. Them old women got some soft ass hands. Hell no. Nah. I'm not gonna be in a fucking no bitch hand, bro. <laughs> 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 well, I wanna put in an order. We got signed, shot a video, and then we quit. <laughs> you went crazy. No, we quit. Why? We was doing too much, getting too much money, moving around too much. Cause I know after the album, yeah, I know y'all did do what the hell y'all wanted to do. Y'all quit, y'all quit after. Hmm. Y'all had a couple hit. Yeah, cause I'm, I'm talking about a couple. Uh, the album came out '04. We yeah. quit like '05. Had yeah. Rocky Hill. Beat your ass. Yeah. So all those Look at me the loud. Mm-hmm. Then now I'm in a whole album. It yeah, so but we, we was doing like three shows a night from Thursday to Sunday. At that point, we didn't care about the money. We didn't care about... You wanted to live life, right? Yeah, we wanted to see our friends. <laughs> so we told our manager, was like, hey, we don't want to do this anymore. Right, right, right. We just quit. He was like, what? We, I'm finna go to d 4 Well, so I booking in. We was like, go. We quit. And then ever since then, y'all just And then we was like, hey, uh, the money's starting to dry up. We we finna rap again. And we did the second album. Right. And then we quit again. <laughs> <laughs> People don't understand. Like, we ain't fall off. We really quit, because shit be lame sometimes. This podcast is sponsored by BetterHelp and 85 South Show listeners. Get 10% off their first month at betterhelp.com backslash 85 South. Hey, I'm Clayton English. It's that time of year again, and seasonal depression is real. BetterHelp can assist with achieving your goals and the happiness you deserve. BetterHelp will assess your needs and match you with your own licensed professional therapist. Services available for clients worldwide, and you can start communicating in under 48 hours. It's not a crisis line. It's not self-help. It is professional counseling done securely online. You'll get timely and thoughtful responses, plus you can schedule weekly video or phone sessions, so you won't ever have to sit in an uncomfortable waiting room as with traditional therapy. BetterHelp is committed to facilitating great therapeutic matches so they make it easy and free to change counselors if needed. You can log into your account anytime and send a message to your counselor. Visit BetterHelp.com backslash 85South. That's Better H-E-L-P and join the over 1 million people who have taken charge of their mental health with the help of an experienced professional. <laughs> <laughs> Y'all already know oh, Pat's gonna come in and get it. Yeah. That's nah. the most coolest, gangsterous nigga you ever want to meet. You got, you got like Like, he don't make that shit up. He ain't, he ain't pretending he's so Pat smooth. one of my favorite rappers of all right. time. How was that? I would choose session. to listen to this nigga music over anybody's shit. My and me and Pat, we the weak man. Me and Pat, we had our own kind of bone. We the type that, you know, like everybody doing them, we sitting back like, look, chat, like, look. You know, you know we like, you know. <laughs> my and Pat cool, Pat so cool. Yeah, the session with Pat, he like, chat, you know, I want you to roast me. I'ma roast you like man, just talk bad. Like man, I got this song called Chicken Head. I'm like Chicken Head. You know, like okay, so when the beat came out, I dropped man first. He came back in like, yeah, hey, you killed this joint. Did you know who? Think about it. I never seen Pat write before. 
I sometimes be like, this shit so hard. Did he write this shit? Like, man, he come out of nowhere. Like, you go in, everybody writing the shit. Pat like a ghost, you gonna disappear. Not leave the building. Go in, you ain't heard. Man, and you come just... out like, man, you ain't right there, fool. Oh yeah, you like, man, yes I did. <laughs> you know what I'm talking about? Killing it. Killing it. So Project Pet just, while you writing, while everybody else writing, right? That nigga gone, and he just come out and he say what, what wind up on the record. Man, he ain't looking like he been even say this shit. So that's why we like, where did shit come from? You just was there looking normal. <laughs> And then we got a whole gorilla on the track right there. <laughs> That's the type of shit you love to hear right there. That like, shit called. Where does shit come from? Because we don't get these stories, especially from goddamn the southern rap artists that goddamn, yeah. Yeah, no, especially the pain. We some different artists, man. It'll never be another DJ Paul. It'll never be another Juicy J. It'll never be another Lord Infamous. It'll never be another Coosta nigga. Never be another Gangsta Boo. Never be another Project Pat. Never be another Lil Chat. Right. Never be another C to Six, Lil White, Frazier Boy. Crunchy Never Black. Be crunchy Black. Yeah. Crunchy so, Black. I can't yeah. wait for this nigga to come out. Did I say his name when I said he need to be on the song? Yeah. Because he for sure need to be on the song. Yeah. Man, Crunchy Black. Crunchy it's been like, the same way since 1990. It's like that nigga, it don't matter if that nigga come on the song and say two bars, it's like, you know that nigga was there though. <laughs> Yeah. Crunchy would never change. I don't care. Now, he one of the ones that can go for the young niggas. Yeah. He yeah. ain't changed. He ain't going to get old. He right. going to be the same Crunchy Black that y'all met back into the club up in 2045, goddammit. Right. <laughs> <laughs> hey, man. Hey, let's get the club up, Crunchy. No, <laughs> fuck that. Leave the club. <laughs> hey, hey, I told you, you can't keep coming in here. <laughs> Motherfucker, you <laughs> We was at the club one time, and these people was getting us drunk as hell. Drunk as fuck. This, this was a learning lesson, too. And then Paul, like, wait a minute, wait a minute. Anybody put your drinks down. These motherfuckers ain't paid us. We like, we like, why are motherfucking money at the dude? Like, Paul got like, hey, tell this motherfucking club up. Oh, they turn the club up. <laughs> That's where the song Some came from. Some nigga come and holler. Bro, you straight, crunch holler. No, he ain't straight, nigga, now what? <laughs> <laughs> Boy, dude got to say, we gonna sue y'all ass, boss. Oh, come on, y'all, time to go. <laughs> man, we had to run up out the club. Juice had to pull pistols in some more, man. Shit was wild as hell. <laughs> but, that's when I learned that you get your money before you go in the club. You got to. You pay me. Mm -hmm. Pay me. I have my money my don't part. depend on whether you sold them to You better yeah, have my, my money at the part, nigga, the NBA. Because it made us look like the bad guys. Mm -hmm. We was dirty. It's hard to say we didn't get our money because we was dirty. Right. So I was learning this. Yeah, we need the money when we get there. Mm -hmm. Before we get out the car yeah. and shit. Yeah. Even because we artists, we don't need to be worried about getting paid. And Boy, shit. them folks told that club That's up. Worse. Give me my money. Oh, it's my money, and I want it now. <laughs> they told us a bad power went and wrote them a check and just sent it to them on GP. <laughs> yeah, they, <had> <laughs> they had to turn that club to a laundromat. Oh after that. man, <laughs> <laughs> crazy. So you know, it is what it is. No, it ain't no pretend though. It's still like that though. That's, we watched the verses. <laughs> man, <laughs> man, what the, the hell? <laughs> yeah. Crazy. I, we didn't expect nothing less, though. I mean, it's three Because y'all had beef back in the past. But we didn't expect it because we've been doing shows with them. Oh, like, you've been doing since some... then, yeah. Like, playing the shows so we didn't understand. It's like me. I'm in the back trying to, you know, act like I ain't there. I'm in the back. I'm drinking some rock, you know, like, yeah, yeah, somebody chat. They up there fighting. I'm like, who? <laughs> what? <laughs> I come up there. And I'm seeing everybody get here, bang, I'm thinking this all that happened. So I go, what they wanna do? I'm thinking like, it's finna get started. <laughs> what they talking about? Well, you know, like, we been doing shows with these body pop flies, what they doing, woo woo. <laughs> Not knowing that it had popped out. Right. I didn't know this shit to the room. Damn. I got back to the room, looked online and said, oh, what? I 
I was even more mad. Man, anytime you got more than four niggas and some liquor, somebody about to get to arguing or bumping or something. Something gonna happen. Four niggas yeah. and some liquor, that's all it takes. Yeah. I ain't have a clue. And, he, and he, it take him to call some folks, some hooking motherfuckers too. It take that yeah, too. Yeah, yeah. He gonna go down. You know? <laughs> yeah. That happens when you get on that liquor. Yeah. You get on that goddamn tequila. It's, it's everybody's subject to be an ugly motherfucker. <laughs> <out there. laughs> Depends on how that much of that shit you. Everybody in this room ugly as fuck. Fuck everybody. All my mama, y'all ugly as fuck. Everybody. Cameraman. Everybody. Oh, y'all. Yeah. And then it'd be the ugly nigga calling everybody ugly. Ugly. <laughs> hey, you. Ugly. Yeah. <laughs> Who ever laughed over there? You ugly, too. <laughs> <see. laughs> <laughs> what that liquor make you feel like that? Oh, that's all. Hey. Yeah, but it was all love, man. You know. It was an age appropriate scuffle, though. <laughs> it yeah. was real age appropriate. It wasn't nothing but some scuffling. Go, Nick, move, 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 Nick. Then you gotta think they were thinking about the money, too. You know, yeah, this let's get the bag, man. Let's get the bag. 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 let us did y'all like the verses? Hell yeah. Who y'all think won? Well, I mean. No, nah, tell the truth. Shit. I know y'all got politics I'm, to be politics. We got a politics, man. <laughs> man, political aspiration. Who they told you? Who, who they say won when y'all were leaving? <laughs> <laughs> who was the score? You was there. You got the, did you get a trophy? <laughs> what was the score? The shit. I mean, I thought it was. And know, I think it's also regional, too. I think a lot of depending on the region that people are from. So for the South, I think a lot of us feel that it was it was you know it yeah. was three six. But I also think the Midwest. But I fuck with both. You know yeah, what I'm saying? Man, we just gonna have to keep it like they had when they was running shit up north. Man, they had the whole rap game. They used to tell us our shit was garbage all the time. Oh, they was talking bad. That shit garbage. You see, God don't like ugly. God don't like ugly. God don't like bad, bro. Boy, they God don't like bad, ugly. Bro. You was dick. Yo, shit is trash, son. Yo, no, all this goddamn. Yo, oh, man, this oh, shit is fucking shit. shit. Yo, niggas ain't got no tips. Niggas ain't got no tips on their feet. Now even the New York niggas don't believe in New York rap. They'll be like, yo, son, what the fuck is this, son? Yo, don't rap like that no more. Yo, son, don't ever say those bars ever again. <laughs> I'ma tell y'all, I was That's excited to see. Ooh. Even though I knew he was coming, but I still was excited to see him. Terrence Howard, man. Oh, when Terrence Howard came, came out? Man. He that came out there. Up. Yeah. No, I saw it. I saw it. Yeah, 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 yeah. Watch that fucked me up. No, I was like, watch it. He, no, he came out and was, and was dead to fuck serious. Yeah. Oh. He, he ain't remember all the words. Oh, now. yeah, you saw it. Yeah. Nigga <laughs> 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 ain't remember never... all the words, I think. <laughs> when the <laughs> <laughs> hey, hey, hey. Right, he ain't yeah. never seen the movie, man. Boy, crazy. <laughs> I don't watch myself. He one of them actors. You know what I I never watch me. If you watch yourself, that takes a piece of your soul. <laughs> that sounds like some shit he'll say. You think I can't watch me? I don't even want him to be Terrence Howard no more, man. He could just be DJ from Hustle and Flow from here on out, man. <laughs> man. He I did show up though. Man. That shit was big though. Yeah. Did he kick it to get the accent and shit? Or he just kind of He like, made up the accent. Well, you know, uh, <laughs> <laughs> like totally Hustle and Flow was filmed in Memphis, so. Yeah. He, yeah, he, he had to, you know, get around a couple of folks to okay. get it. So he was in the studio a little bit. Yeah. He might have been in the studio with a 3-6 session. Yeah. He's an actor, man. He can fake that shit. <laughs> How you talk when he get home? Oh my God! <laughs> Such a long day on set. <laughs> this accent is really, really troublesome. I, I just don't understand. Like, why would anybody choose to suck the night? Just places I can't reach in my cerebral uh, cortex. Fuck, it's stupid. I know, Damn. man. We're gonna stop this shit. <laughs> this show is gonna be our fucking downfall. People are gonna watch this shit and think we are terrible people. Oh, that's all right. 
Hey, my MJG was good, you know. Great. Yeah. There's a lot of Memphis just, Memphis, like I said, y'all was up on some shit Man, early. Ball and G, though, it's like, nigga, them niggas was like the first first. How many y'all 93, right? see people still together like that? Shit. Like, them yeah. folks flew in together. Hey, Ball and G, they flew in together. Yeah. They walked together. They went, we ate at the same restaurants. We was riding first class. They was in the same seats. Yeah. Who still together like that? No right. fucking body. Right. Like yeah, Bert and Ernie ain't even together, together no more. <laughs> <laughs> For real. Bert and Ernie ain't even together Hell no now. more. <laughs> Shit, everybody done broke up. Hey man, where Ernie at? <laughs> Fuck Ernie. <laughs> Damn. This motherfucker like off me. You ask me about motherfucking Ernie. <laughs> Maybe your what? computer knew she was hitting me. She needs to hit me. <laughs> Play no shit. shit. Came back on. Shit. Oh, shit. <laughs> hey, but that is dope, though. You know, longevity, man. Man, for real. Yeah. They, like, yeah. they, they energy is good. Yeah. yeah. I was like, man, it's just legend just to see y'all two together. Come on, man. Like, for real. To, yeah. We all that long. separate planes. They were over side. I believe hey, them niggas' regular conversation got to sound like rap. <laughs> what they saying? I don't know. It's just nigga. Everything that they say, that shit just has got to be the same shit. Yeah. Yeah. Then we just lost Dolph. You know. God damn. damn rest in peace, Dolph. I'm bring it up. Yeah. I'm still mourning. Yeah. Man, rest in peace, Dolph. You know. Everything I do, I'm going to try to bring them up. Like I tell people, That's you know, real. it could have been in our Memphis and dope. I ain't choosing no side. I just feel like Memphis and man, we got our own style, our own cultures. Anybody putting on for the city, man, deserves to live, especially in the city. You know what I'm saying? In the city. Now, let's go somewhere else and then something happen, but come on, man. In the city, though. Yeah, no nothing right. supposed to happen to you at home. Man, right. so you know, I, I hate it happen. I hate it with a passion, but you know, Memphis, we gotta do better. Gas yeah. to do better. Dolph is, you know, the hood homeboy. You, hey. He, he, he just, he got too comfortable. I ain't gonna take that away from him, but who would ever thought it? We never thought it. We, right. we been seeing him get right. too comfortable. Nobody say, nigga, you too comfortable. So why y'all saying it now? Right. You know, don't wait till nigga get killed then try to tell him what he shouldn't have did. Right. Somebody should have been telling him that when he was doing it in a lab. Hindsight. You know, don't knock him for being him after he died. You right. know what I'm saying? Like he just is being him. That's and, real. You know. Yeah. Should let that marry. But rest in peace, Doc, man. Rest you know, peace, never gonna be forgotten. He got his peace. own street. You know. Come on, Adolf man. Junior Boulevard. Yeah, Adolf <laughs> Junior Boulevard. Come on. Man. And the crazy part about it, daddy, like. I was just watching his drink champs the other day, and uh, uh, they asked him about, y'all got Eric Spencer Boulevard? He said, yeah, it should be called Dog Boulevard. I said, well, guess what, nigga? You got your own boulevard now, yeah, nigga. Yeah, 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 yeah. I said, you yeah. smoke that bitch up, yeah. nigga. Yeah, yeah. nigga, yeah. yeah, nigga. Yeah. You got it now. Yeah, he talked a lot <laughs> of shit up, too. Yeah, he spoke it up. Yeah, yeah. Look, Chad, what's your social media so they can follow my, you? My social media, y'all follow me on IG. It's Lil Chat, L A C H A T underscore IG. Uh, my Twitter at The Real Lil Chat. That's D A R E A L L A C H A T. If y'all want to book me, it's Lil Chat Bookings, L A C H A T B O O K I N G S dot com. Well, there you have it, folks. Let's go. Yeah, we appreciate you stopping through the Memphis track. Legend. Thank y'all, man. Memphis Legend. Legend. Yeah. Anytime. 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 Anytime.
Try that with your car. I will. Who's right to feed me, brother? Okay. Okay. Put it here. Mm -hmm. Long head, scary way. Hey. And she drinking too. You drinking too? Did they hey, get, auntie. Is that like the wheelchair special? You only get that drink if you're in the wheelchair? You gotta, you gotta let your skirt down. I, I, I see it. I see it. Yeah, that seatbelt got that little puss out. You better put that little puss up. That motherfucker up. Hey, don't put All it up. Right. They'll put it up. You she already fucking, know. That motherfucker fat. She can take a dick too. She can. She don't feel nothing. Go ahead, keep fucking. I'm oh, you it. crazy as hell. You think that little pussy don't work? <laughs> she, she can't walk, but if you rub that clit like this, both legs look like this. <laughs> Nightlife song. Yeah, nightlife with Dro. Man, stop. Yeah, this nigga. Man, you man, fuck with me, man. Mike. You fuck with me, bro. <laughs> that nigga studied that shit. He ain't know it. He studied the shit. He studied the shit before man, the show. Man, you ain't know it. That's I always had the research. And I thought it was cool. Man, you slide that bitch in in his drink. Watch that nigga. Watch that. Watch that, man. Man. He got with my outfit. He got with my size outfit. Nah, cause he the type of nigga where it's like, you'll be cool with him. him. Oh, uh, shit. But then you'll never know that he ain't cool with you. <laughs> you ain't cool with me now? Hey, man. Well, I'm fuck with Just you, watch man. how that nigga move, man. I'm I, you can be so cool. Tell me the All I'm saying is, I done seen the nigga be a one-sided friend. Before. So, like, what's the best Christmas gift you ever got? <laughs> hey, man, you can't ride with me here no more. <laughs> Yeah, I ain't know he was gonna be here. I hope he bought that shit. Merry Christmas, everybody. 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 Merry Christmas, everybody.